Hi friends, in this video, I'm gonna make a multi-pattern bike hazard flasher. It's gonna be a fun project, so without further ado, let's start this video. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe and don't forget to press the bell icon so you can get notifications whenever I upload a new video. These are my other channels, do subscribe them as well. And you can also follow me on Facebook and Instagram. Component list, circuit diagram, everything is in the description below. So these are all the components we're gonna need for this project. First connect AD Tiny 85 microcontroller and connect its pin number 4 to ground and its pin number 8 to positive supply. After that connect a 10k resistor and connect its one pin to pin number 1 of the microcontroller and its other pin to pin number 8 of the microcontroller. After that connect a 3 pin terminal block and connect its center pin to ground. After that connect a 1k resistor and connect its one pin to one side pin of three pin terminal block and its other pin to pin number five of the microcontroller. After that, connect a two pin terminal block. After that, connect a 1K resistor and connect its one pin to one side pin of two pin terminal block and its other pin to pin six of the microcontroller. After that, connect a 1K resistor and connect its one pin to remaining pin of two pin terminal block and its other pin to pin 7 of the microcontroller. After that, connect a 7805 regulator and connect its pin number 1 to remaining pin of 3 pin terminal block, its pin number 2 to ground and its pin number 3 to pin number 8 of the microcontroller. After that, connect a 47 microfarad capacitor and connect its positive pin to pin number 1 of the regulator and its negative pin to ground. After that, connect a 0.1 microfarad capacitor and connect its one pin to pin number one of the regulator and its other pin to ground. After that, connect a 10 microfarad capacitor and connect its positive pin to pin number three of the regulator and its negative pin to ground. After that, connect a 0.1 microfarad capacitor and connect its one pin to pin number three of the regulator and its other pin to ground. After that, connect a 12 volt relay and connect its one coil pin and its common pin to pin number one of the regulator. After that, connect a two pin terminal block and connect its one pin to normally open pin of the relay. After that, connect a BC547 transistor and connect its pin number one to remaining coil pin of the relay. After that, connect a 10K resistor and connect its one pin to pin number three of the microcontroller and its other pin to pin number 2 of the transistor. After that, connect a 1N4148 diode and connect its anode to pin number 1 of the transistor and its cathode to pin number 1 of the regulator. After that, connect an LED and connect its cathode to pin number 1 of the transistor. After that, connect a 1K resistor and connect its one pin to anode of the LED and its other pin to pin number 1 of the regulator. After that, connect a 12 volt relay and connect its one coil pin and its common pin to pin number one of the regulator and its normally open pin to remaining pin of two pin terminal block. After that, connect a BC547 transistor and connect its pin number one to remaining coil pin of the relay. After that, connect a 10K resistor and connect its one pin to pin number two of the microcontroller and its other pin to pin number two of the second transistor. After that, connect a 1N4148 diode and connect its anode to pin number one of the second transistor and its cathode to pin number one of the regulator. After that, connect an LED 
and connect its cathode to pin number 1 of the second transistor. After that, connect a 1K resistor and connect its one pin to anode of the second LED and its other pin to pin number 1 of the regulator. So we have completed all the connections. Now let's upload this code to 80 tiny 85 microcontroller. Now let's test the project.
So that's it for today's video. I hope you have enjoyed this video. For more videos like that, stay tuned and I will see you in the next video.